Okay, guys, I know y'all been asking questions on what all that I be using, what type of nukes I be using. Typically, I don't like talking about them, but since I'm doing a water change today, um, I will go a little bit more in depth on what I'm using and when I'm using and how much I'm using uh, to this particular growth system here itself. Okay, so when I'm in my veg stage, this is what I use, CalMag by General Hydroponics for Nova Grow and Silica Blast. This is what I use. 250 parts per million on the, the CalMag is what I use. And depending on the stage of the plant, I will get my system up to about 320 all the way up to about 600 parts per million in veg okay and this is what i use these two products here then i add the silica blast once all of this here has neutrified the system and it's stable so and we know that the parts per million is close to where we need it to be at and the ph on the system is where it's at if it is low then we start adding the silica blast and the silica blast is very beneficial for the roots but also for the structure of the plant itself okay and we use this here and we're gonna bring that up to where that it it has my ph level okay to where i need it to be at okay now we still continue to use this here all the way until our fourth week in veg these are the products that we use uh for, for uh throughout our whole time okay now we add a different addition first week of flower we add the liquid cool bloom and it tells you to use two milliliters per gallon but i start off at one milliliter per gallon on the first week on the second week i will still do one milliliters per gallon because it still takes time for them to suck up and get used to it okay now after the fourth week of being in flower i get rid of this and i introduce the floor nova bloom i will still keep this here at 250 milliliters uh 250 parts per million on this here and i will get the system up to about 650 with this and i will still give it this cool bloom at two milliliters Per gallon okay because I want to keep it up under the 700 okay and I will still add the silica blast on my six week seventh week I will get rid of CalMag silica blast liquid cool bloom and I will just do these two products right here now I will use this here at 500 parts per million and then from there i will boost this here up and get that up to about 650 680 parts per million okay and if the ph is off depending on if you need to go up this is the ph up if you need to go down this is the ph down okay so these are the general hydroponic products that i do use in my garden and I've been using them from day one. The only other addition to the party is this Botanicare Silica Blast. That's the only one I use that's outside of it. And the reason why I use the Botanicare is because it pairs perfectly with the products that I do have uh, that, is for, uh, uh, that is in front of you now, okay? Now, I know people might be like, hey, there are other products that you don't even have to do that. We have Athena, the products like that. Yeah, I know that they have those products, but these products here, I know them so freaking well, I might have well designed them my own self because I know them so well. And because I know them so well, I am now able to show you guys how to actually utilize these products in the basic simplicity way, okay? Instead of me trying to learn something else and another nutrient lines, I feel like they are all pretty much the same, okay? All right, so what we're gonna go ahead and do instead of we rambling, we're gonna use the cow mag right now. And let's go ahead and get rid of what we're not going to be using. 
and keep what we are going to be using okay these are the products that we are going to be using today okay all right so we're going to go ahead and put 200 milliliters of cow mag off in there okay let's go ahead and do that okay and now we're going to neutrify the system now that we have the cow mag off in there we're going to let that sit and let that do its thing for a minute and hopefully we can be somewhere around uh, 250 300 remember we started off with 30 parts per million so do our reductions we will need to do 250 plus 30 that's 280 so three, 300 to 280 i'm cool with that okay all right okay now that we have that already circulated we have 310 parts per million and we have 6.4 uh, 6 on our pH. So our next step is to measure out 150 parts per uh, 150 milliliters of the floor bloom. Okay, and let that neutrify the system. You see how everything is going up. Okay, and then it's gonna eventually balance it way back down as the system circulates itself. That's what we're that's what we're trying to get it to do. And then we're gonna see what our overall numbers is gonna turn out to be. Um, hopefully, it'll get close to where I need to add them because I still need to add some of the cool bloom off in there, and I'm gonna add that now. And I'm going to do 200 milliliters of the cool bloom. And typically, I only do 100 milliliters. But this time, I'm doing 200. And we're going to let that do what it do, okay? All right, there we go, guys. 640, 5.8, and the degrees is 774. All right, man. I appreciate you guys coming and checking out the video, man. And this is how I do and use the general hydroponics feeding system all right guys have a dang day and hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel peace